Hello, welcome to another lecture. In this lecture, we are going to be talking about design intent. Design intent is how your model behaves when dimensions are modified. So we are going to use this simple sketch as an example. And when we look at this sketch, everything is identical. Um, the dimensions are the same. The location of the holes are also the same. The only difference between these two sketch is the way the holes are dimensioned. So let's change the dimension of the weight of each sketch to 12. I'm going to change that to 12 and change this to 12. So we can see what happened. The, the holes will always maintain the two inches from each edge, regardless of the length of this, the weight of this um, rectangle. So as we change it, it will always maintain two inches from the edge. But on this sketch, the weight of this rectangle does not affect the hole. The hole is controlled by the eight and the two. So it does not matter if we change this to 15. The hole remains the same and the weight keeps increasing. Versus here, if we change it to 15, it would always maintain that two inches from the edge. So that's what we mean by design intent. How you dimension your part would affect how your part updates when you have to change some dimensions in the future. So that's what you just want to keep in mind that you always want to dimension your part based on how you want it to update. So that is the design intent in a nutshell. Thank you and let please let me know if you have any questions and I will see you in the next lecture. Bye.